Hi, my name's Ashley and today I'm going to show you how I make pasta. We're going to use plain flour. If you have double zero flour at home, that's fine. And if you're gluten free, you can use gluten free flour. We're going to use eggs and a rolling pin. If you are also an egg free house, you can use water and oil as a substitute. Two cups of flour into the bowl. Make a well in the middle. We're going to pour in one egg slowly at a time and mix them in. We're using two cups of flour, so we'll use four eggs. And once all of your eggs are combined into the flour and they start to resemble breadcrumbs, we will tip it all out onto the bench top to knead it out into a ball of dough. Kneading is an essential part of making pasta as it helps release the gluten in your flour, which then helps your pasta keep its form when it's cooking. If your pasta is a little bit dry, you can add small amounts of water until it hits a nice smooth consistency. After resting it for 30 minutes, taking it out of the fridge, uh, split it into smaller sections and knead it out onto the table. We add some flour to the bench top and to the top of the pasta to help it from sticking to the rolling pin. Rolling it out to about one to two mils, smaller if possible, as it helps um, your pasta expands as it cooks. We'll fold it over and using a knife, cut that end piece off so that it's nice and straight and then cut it to any thickness you like, depending on what pasta dish you are making. Once it's all cut up, spread it out, shake the excess flour off and your pasta is ready to cook.